KSPW Weather with meteorologist Art Jarrett. Well, good morning to you. Live view from Monterey Portola Hotel and Spa. A few high clouds out there. Some patchy fog out in the distance for the Monterey Bay, but all in all, it was a great start to a wonderful day. We'll see mild conditions on the bay today, and then the inland valleys will still continue to warm up. And I'm including the mountains in that as well. You can see down uh, to Southern California, you can see the winds changing. That's a bit of a southerly surge that's starting to kick into place. It's already forming in Los Angeles, working around the corner for Santa Barbara, and we'll keep an eye on it. We know for sure that it's going to be definitely coming in for Thursday, but some of the clouds and fog are already be lingering around the Monterey Peninsula, cooling our temperatures down significantly. But the high pressure itself taking the storm track well to the north, and everything is starting to ramp up a little bit more so. So we'll see more coastal fog working in the area. In fact, as we go into the overnight hours, we'll go eventually to about mostly cloudy conditions and then go clear to partly cloudy skies to mostly cloudy skies uh, tomorrow. Here we go. 59 in uh, Eureka to 50 uh, to the 60s and 70s and 80s right along the coastline. Still holding on to the 80s you get into San Francisco and the 90s in the interior valley. So we have the difference in temperature is going to stir up the winds. And by the time we get into tomorrow, we'll start to see those winds really begin to pick up. In fact, here's a look now. You look down to the south. These winds eventually will move uh, to the south, working out of the south, and that's going to guide up more of that cloud cover coming in. The outer water is still holding on to some of that patchy fog, and that's going to help to keep our temperatures fairly cool as we go into the uh, the Monterey uh, area by the, by the peninsula, especially when the surge comes in, it'll affect Santa Cruz more significantly. Then by the time we get into Thursday, you'll start to see those winds back up, clouds start to roll in, and we'll keep coastal clouds along the coastline, and then we're starting to look at uh, 60s and 70s back along the coast for the better part of the uh, work week. We go to 90 in Ben Lomond today, 77 in Salinas, as well as Santa Cruz. We'll pick up temperatures around Monterey, about 70 degrees and 80 as you go into Big Sur today. And then as you go into the inland side, we'll have those numbers still widespread 90s for you. I've cooled off Carmel Valley because of the chance of some uh, patchy fog moving into the area. So 86 degrees there, plenty of sunshine for everybody. Then tonight we'll call, go clear to mostly cloudy skies, little patchy coastal fog, fewer clouds inland and much needed relief coming in with a little bit of a breeze through the evening hours. And then by the time we get past midnight, those temperatures uh, will uh, uh, the winds will back off. Mild conditions today at the coast, breezy conditions through uh, Saturday, getting a chance of rainfall for Sunday. And of course, wraparound moisture could come back again for Wednesday. Inland side will see more of the same as well with hot temperatures today and then breezy into your weekend.